fellow Toastmasters, our guests, and particularly Sheila. I hope I receive your approbation at the conclusion of this evaluation. You gave us a wonderful uh, demonstration of the art of growing flowers from bulbs, which I appreciate. I, for one, was not aware of some of the things that you taught me today, so again, thank you very much for that. You demonstrated in a very convincing manner. You had the, your props here. You had good visual aids. You dressed with the right attire. You set the stage purposefully. Your objective in this speech number three, besides the typical organize and have a constructive speech and use gestures and everything, you were speaking to either do one of two or three or four different things, to inform, to persuade, to entertain, or to inspire. You know, I found a little bit of a, each of those in your speech today, so I think you did all four. Now, typically you do one of the four, but in this case, I think you did all four. So I, I particularly enjoyed the speech very much. What would I suggest in the areas of improvement? One of the things that I was disturbed by a bit seated on this side is this darn lectern. So I would have suggested that prior to the delivery that you remove the lectern, sit it on the floor. In fact, you, can you could have had this lowered so that when you're demonstrating these things so effectively that everyone on both sides of the room could see that. So that's a, an area to work on. Definitely move into lectern, as I said. One of the other minor areas of concern is that you had some of your activity centered around here. You talked to the table. So I would encourage you to demonstrate your skills, but continue to make the eye contact so that people see that and you communicate effectively there. But all in all, I think you achieved the purpose of making sure that you informed us, you entertained us, you did, had great visuals, wonderful hand gestures, nice vocal variety. I think you accomplished your objective in spades. So thank you. Thank you.